I mentioned off the top of the show there, the Federal Court of Appeal has dismissed the Competition Bureau's appeal of a tribunal decision um, in terms of uh, Rogers' deal to buy Shaw. For the latest on this, we're joined by David George Kosh. So can you uh, break down what we know about this decision and what it means? Yeah, so the Competition Bureau's commissioner sought um, to uh, appeal the um, ruling from the Competition Tribunal um, because uh, the tribunal last year, late last year, ruled in favor of the takeover of this Roger Shaw deal. And the main thrust of the Competition Bureau's, uh, the Competition Commissioner's argument was that there was no uh, the, the behavioral remedies in terms of the backhaul and service options that Freedom Mobile and Videotron would continue to have under Rogers uh, was not necessarily taken into account, as well as the substantial lessening or prevention of competition, um, according to um, earlier reporting from our colleague Paul Bagnell. Now, the Federal Court of Appeal judge has um, dismissed those uh, concerns, saying that the motion to leave for leave uh, uh, regarding fresh evidence and the appeal of the steal was dismissed with costs. The standard of error has not been met, according to the judges uh, on the Federal Court of Appeal, um, and they do um, side with the competition tribunal's arguments as to approving this deal, as well as the memorandums um, that both Rogers and Shaw lawyers have submitted um, following the uh, tribunal's um, uh, uh, ruling late last year ahead of the appeal court's uh, ruling itself. So uh, what's next, uh, I, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, again, this is a very dense legal uh, argument that I, I'm trying to uh, distill for our viewers here. Um, going forward, it, it, I, I think it's unknown whether or not uh, at this point the Competition Bureau will seek uh, uh, to escalate this to the Supreme Court of Canada. Um, that being said, tomorrow we have the Industry of, and Technology Committee uh, will be conducting a second review on the, the Deal primarily focused on the divestiture of Freedom Mobile by Videotron. So that will be key in focus. But right now, the Competition Bureau's argument uh, has been dismissed by the Federal Court of Appeal, and that appears to at least clear the pathway for this deal to finally get closed nearly two years after it was first announced. Yeah, 